discrepancy? What would you uh, say to those numbers looking at that tonight? Yeah, it was an emphasis coming into the game. Um, you know, credit to you know Anthony Davis, to their whole group. You know, getting to the free throw line. Um, you know, we got to be better. We got to be more disciplined. Um, keep them off the free throw line. Curious, when you obviously went small, was that just a matter of speed the game up, get back in, it, or maybe just explain that for those like reasons? Yeah, you know, I mean, I think we we tried it a couple different times. Uh, you know, and late. You know, I think it's a little bit of an opportunity for us to spread the court out, um, you know, try and play a little bit faster, a little bit more pressure up into the ball. Um, you know, the guys, you know, they made a few plays, and, um, you know, we needed one more rebound, um, which is, you know, that's that's a give and take sometimes of, uh, of lineup choices. So, uh, but they, they uh, you know, they tried that, that with the spread lineup. Well, you look at just... Real quick, when you look at the first quarter, the way the offense was flowing, threes going up, maybe what was working then and what maybe you guys got away from for the rest of the game? Um, you know, I mean, I think it usually starts with getting stops. I thought we had a really good defensive first quarter. Um, that usually fuels our offense and, you know, kind of the flow. So, um, you know, it felt like they were on the free throw line uh, in the second quarter, and then it also felt like we turned the ball over in the second quarter. Over So... You know, I think those two things, uh, the free throw line and the turnovers, um, you know, that stretch where, um, you know, in the second quarter really hurt us. Hey, Coach, I know it's super early, only two games in, but I'm curious how you feel about your guys' three-point generation so far. No, I mean, it's an emphasis. Uh, you know, I think that we want to find good shots and good opportunities. And, um you know, I think that uh, we got to continue to find the paint. We got to continue to get there. Um, that's usually how you generate some threes. So, um, you know, screening better. But, uh, you know, I think, uh, you know, like you said, it's early. I think it's in a decent spot right now. And, and but to that point that it's early, how do you look at how Kevin's just managing a bunch of different responsibilities with the workload and playing different positions? Um, yeah, I mean, he's... You know, he's a player. He's like everybody else. Um, you know, we're trying to play with, uh, you know, guys able to be in different spots and play in flow and random. And, um, you know, everybody's learning something a little new, a little different. But, you know, he's uh, his size and length gives us an ability to do some different things with him, you know, defensively, offensively. Uh, he's been great. Coach, the, the challenge with Nurkic and, and trying to win the play, obviously the foul trouble can – affect his game, but how do you feel like you utilize him tonight considering the game that Davis had? Yeah, no, I mean, you know, I think the, the free throws for Davis are a big part of how he scores. Um, you know, both Nurk and Mason being in a little bit of foul trouble. Um, you know, I think Nurk is, uh, you know, somebody that's capable of defending, you know, not just Davis, but all the good bigs and um, gives us a presence in the paint and on the boards. And, um, you know, so he'll have his nights. Thanks, Paul. All right, thanks.